Hi, welcome back to Kyler B Music and Reviews. Another new week, another new video. This week we have another bass. Um, this is a short scale bass, more like something a guitar player would play. Um, this is a Mitchell, which is the Guitar Center brand. This is a uh, MB100 PB, and I'm thinking that's precision bass, is what PB stands for. Um, again, this is a short scale bass. It has a rosewood fretboard on it. There's a super slim neck on it. Um, this particular one was made in China. Uh, I've seen these 150 bucks. They aren't that bad for a guitar player or somebody that wants to dabble in the bass. You don't have one around your little studio or just, just to mess around with, have it in the corner. Um, you don't have a lot of money into these. These don't play that bad. Um, you know, again, coming from a guitar, it's kind of strange, but you can have a lot of fun with this. Um, this one, I don't believe has been set up. Um, it does, it does look like it needs one bad. The frets are kind of sharp. Um, but these Mitchell, as with the guitar that I had demoed before, I wanted to try one of the basses to see if the basses were as good a quality as that guitar was. And this isn't bad. I'd probably buy one of these over a more expensive Ibanez, um, just to learn on and then move into a actual Fender bass. Um, I probably wouldn't buy one of the Ibanez ones. I don't like how thin their neck is. It's really super thin for their bases. Um, but this one isn't bad. Out of the box, it's not, the fret ends aren't tearing my fingers up. Um, again, it does need setting up. This ne neck needs an adjustment. I can see that just by looking at it. Um, double pickup so it has two volumes one tone um, the tuners aren't 800 percent way too big to where it goes on you this one actually when you put it on it does feel nice it does stay in a playable position obviously with the shorter scale neck on it it's probably going to work out a little bit better on that um, I've seen these in a bunch of different colors don't be afraid to give one of these a try I think this is a great base um, again, for a beginner or a guitarist that just wants to have one to play around with, you don't spend a thousand bucks on it. Um, so we're going to do a little demo with this thing and see if I can make a misery out of it as I usually do. Um, and I'll see you on the other side.
what you think. Is it worth 150 bucks, 120 bucks, whatever these are selling for? Um, I can't remember what this one went for, but you can you can have a lot of fun for not a lot of money. And like I've said in, in my all my videos, and I, it's, I'll say it 10,000 times more. Have fun. We get one time at this earth. You gotta have fun. If it brings a smile to your face and you don't play this worth beans, play it as long as you have fun. You gotta have fun. If you got a kid that wants to learn, here you go. This isn't a, a like some of the value pack stuff that I've seen, they're just horrendous. This you're actually getting a, a real base. Um, so again, if you got a kid that wants to learn, or even an adult who want to learn, but you don't have a lot of money, you can even buy one of these, probably used for under 100 bucks. Um, so don't be afraid to try it. It's Mitchell. This is an MB100PB. I keep forgetting that number. Um, <laughs> give it a shot. Have some fun. Play around with it. I'm Kyla B. I appreciate you stopping by. Take care.